Hello and welcome to the third episode of Moto Evolved. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day because I'm, you know, having I'm just having a decent day because of reasons, right? To explain to you what happened, yeah, like, yeah. <coughs> I did record the part of the third episode and I found out that my microphone was muted. So, just to recap, what I've been doing, basically, is I wanted to make a simple tree farm, yeah? I decided I want to go with the forestry tree farm, yeah? And I built the smallest um, forestry tree farm that I could, because this is a multi-block, basically. Uh, it's basically, you know, simple multi-block. And I built the smallest one because that's like all the resources I had to make it, right? So to build it, I needed to make a thermonic fabricator and make some some of that stuff, tin electron tube, yeah. To make the forestry block. Let's see, forest. No, actually they are called uh, farm blocks, if I'm not mistaken. So the farm blocks are rather cheap if you have copper. Uh, the most expensive part was the tin electron tubes, but yeah, that's that's it. And uh, if you needed to, then I needed to get like three more items: the farm gearbox that accepts the power, and the farm hatch where I can like pull in and pull out items. Yeah, and then the farm valve where I'm gonna put, be putting water in, and we have a farm control there also which I have no clue what actually does actually I'm gonna make one of those real quick just to see what what the hell what the hell it's all about you know I need to find out what the hell it's all about exactly exactly so I'm just gonna snag the corner one and turn you into a farm control block because apparently that's the thing, so I'm gonna make you. Right. Need one tin electron tube. Okay, just, you know. I'm just gonna throw you on the floor at the moment. So, one of you, right? One of you and two redstone. Something like that. Oh. I forgot the recipe. I totally forgot the recipe, mate. I totally forgot it. Um. Oh, it's a golden electric tube. Right, I gotcha. Okay, so I'm not gonna make one of you. Screw you, man. You're expensive. Nah, golden electric tube should be relatively simple. But then I need to cup. Oh. Okay, right. Just deal with me for one second. Right, gonna change the recipe with gold. And one, two redstone. Oh wow! Someone, someone's on the server. I didn't know. I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know. Sorry, I didn't know you. No, that scared me. Right, and we need a piece of glass. Right, if I'm not mistaken. There we go. Golden electro uh, electro tubes. Real, really easy to make those. So there we go. And now I'm gonna you back out because you're gonna keep constantly drawing power and I need to save my power because power I actually ran out of coal so I've been chopping down trees because yeah I needed the power so let's replace you there we go so what happened no idea what this is actually I think that's a redstone signal, uh, so we can turn on and off the farm. I think that's it. Cool, actually. Normal H. But button down the hatches. Pipes and tube. Right. So, give me a minute. I need to rethink what the hell I'm doing. Uh, I know I'm gonna need some kind of water source going on so yeah let me grab all the resources I need and I will be back when I'm gonna build this 
cute little thing. Right. For power, we're gonna go for a aqueous accumulator, acu accumulator, something, something. Yeah, aqueous accumulator. Right. That's a hard word to pronounce. Oh wow, well, I had you. See, so we're gonna need first tin gear. What the hell? One tin gear. Surround it with glass and iron in the corner to get the machine frame. So this is all thermal expansion. Yeah, it, it's a really cool technical mod. I, you know, I love to use those. Um, I don't know. Uh, and yeah. Anyway, then then we're gonna need two copper gear, right? Boom, two copper gear. And there is easier way to do this, right? If I just click the accumulus, I click uh, there, there, and I need two pieces of glass. There, there, there. I need one of you actually. One of you, to be honest. And then we're gonna need. There we go. You know what I did, yeah, was basically shift clicking the recipe into the crafting table, and if I have all the item, it will like. Lay it out, out for me. Really easy, really easy. Like when when you start using it, you, you can't go back. You can't. It, it's integrated in the not enough item mod. I think I, I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that, but I think that's like something that not enough item does. Yeah. Anyway, so let's get some water in here. So I was actually planning to have a large infinity. Um, uh, infinite water source right there, but with this block, I only need to have a water there, a water source block there, and a water source block there, and one of you there, and you should be drinking all the water you need and fill up my farm basically. So I don't really need all of this, this huge mess of a, uh, I don't know what to call it. Uh, well, it's not really a huge, huge mess, but yeah, that saves me to pipe actually water into the, the uh, thingamaji as well. And I think you're just a simply redstone controller, so I'm not going to be too worried about you. And here we need some power, hmm, and that's something I really don't have at the moment. So, let's dig some more into thermal expansion. Or actually, I could go another way. I know, I know. But, oh, can we make one of you? We can. Uh, right, well. That would be really cool if we could make one of those, but oh, nah, nah, it's just too silly. Right, let's go first with a leadstone energy cell frame, redstone block, lead, and glass around it. And I'm out of glass once again. And since my smelter is busy, smelting stuff for me. Oh my god, I need to use more resources quickly. Are you making al aluminum? Right. Um, Oh, wow, look at that. I got loads of tin. And you should be pushing. Okay, fine. Never mind, I'm just grubbling doing stuff. So, yeah, I, I need to use more resources at the moment. But anyway, let's make that many sand. Yeah, that's you know, actually, what the hell not. I know one coal block can smell like tall items. Unless it's some silly mods that takes forever for it to cook. Yeah, anyway. Mm, what else do we need for the leadstone? Right, we need... <laughs> bloody hell. We need a redstone block. One of you only. I only need one of you. Then I need some of the glass. Perfect. And yeah, of course, don't forget the lead, which I'm swarming in. 
I have too much lead at the moment, so that's not gonna be a bottleneck for me. Not for me. And then we need the leadstone energy frame, which is require more glass. It's more no way. We need three copper and our electrum ingot. Right, electrum. That simply silver and gold. And you might be wondering how I'm going to get it. Right. So what I'm going to do is take all of you out, put you to all this mode only, grab a piece of gold and a piece of silver, and actually, while I'm at it, let's make five of those. It seems like a round number. And that's why I love the alloy smelter from under IO. First of all, it's not too expensive, and second of all, it can make alloy 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 so much easier. Uh, but see, see, we got we got everything we need. I mean, I can also make ingvar, which is always a hassle for me to make early game, but not now. Now it's like really easy to make. So we got that thingy. Um, what do you need? Three copper, right? So copper, uh, I'm I'm running really low on that one, uh, that resource. But yeah, we got that some thingamajig. Nice. Actually, do I have ingvar made? No ingvar, right? Ingvar is. Another alloy, I think it's two iron and one ferrous metal. And I now have l a decent amount of ferrous. Let's see, oh there we go. One of you. And that should melt into... Yeah. Into ingvar. It should. Yeah, perfect. So, two iron and... And uh, it's night time, so t t tonight I'm gonna sleep because someone else is too busy to sleep. Bloody hell, bloody woman! I don't don't even know why why she's here. Uh, right. So let's upgrade it this uh, cell to hardened uh, energy cell cell. What else is the sound? And I will be back shortly. Yeah, no idea what happened. Um, it was a stream I had in the background that suddenly started working for some reason. I mean, it gave, gave sound. How the hell did I get a gold coin? Ah, uh, never mind. Yeah, uh, yeah. I was gonna make the horn energy energy cell Re really easy to do. Uh, it's just a leadstone energy energy cell and surrounded with ingvar. Perfect. So the reason it didn't work to shift click it in is because of a bug bug. Um because of item ID thingamaji. Um so uh, th this is gonna be a pain to explain to be honest. Um how the hell am I going to explain this to you? Uh, right, okay, I'm not going to explain it, but it's it's bug. Sometimes, sometimes it happens. So what I'm going to do is fill up this energy energy cell, and get the tree farm started up. And I will be back uh, in a bit. Okay, I'm back. I'm back in black, and we are almost ready to like. Get started, really. First of all, I want to make an axe. Don't ask a question. Just, just make an axe. It's just an axe, man. I'm not gonna kill you with it. Hit you with a bloody axe. No, it's not gonna be a bloody axe. It's gonna be a green axe. I'm not making sense. I, I know. Trust me. I know. Right. So first of all, we need to fill up this one up with saplings and luckily I've been chopping down trees like a maniac and because of decaying 
waiting for saplings to drop, but doesn't really take long. And yeah, we got loads of saplings, and we're gonna need some dirt. Perfect. Gonna need some dirt. And what's the last thing we need? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I know. We need some sand. And you may be asking, why sand? Well, we're gonna make some fertilizer from forestry. Dun dun. And if I'm not mistaken, okay. Then it's it's this recipe. Boom! Fertilizer. Fertilizer for days. Fertilizer for days. So this is actually the the smallest farm I can make. Yeah, I think I already man mentioned that. And uh, so I'm not quite sure if we are gonna be able to make my usual system. Uh, if you watch my last series, uh, go to Minecraft. I used a, um, oh, I used a, uh, another mod for a tree farm. I used the Minecraft Mine Factory. T to be honest. And do you have power, or do I need to have a pipe connection connected between you? I think I do. Because you won't accept power, right? Luckily, you know, you know, because I'm awesome and all, all of that. I have some left over power con conduits from under IO. It's I, I don't really like those and uh, conduits. I mean, they have a really cool. Uh, uh, fu uh, future, uh, not future, uh, feature that you can run multiple. Oh, that makes sense. That's why. Uh, I mean, okay, note to self you're never gonna need to. Okay, it could power now. Uh, you never need to show power in the hatch. No, no. So, yeah, we got a small farm going. And it looks amazing. It looks amazing. It looks so amazing. Okay, what I'm gonna do is make a simple test of something to see if my circle is correct. So you may have noticed that I set up the 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 farm on st and like make uh, made uh, stone bricks around it. Uh, it's one of the requirements I believe for it to okay yeah to be able to plant on top of it. Uh, I'm not sure. I think it is, uh, but I'm not quite sure. Uh, so yeah, yeah. Uh, we got a, a tree farm going. Uh, what we don't have going is power. You're actually not draining, draining much power. Oh, okay, yeah, this is gonna work. Um, right, what, what I'm gonna, gonna do, yeah, yeah, is we're gonna make some stuff. Uh, give, me, give me a minute to sort my thoughts out and, uh, yeah, I'm gonna sort everything out and I will be back shortly. I knew I needed that axe, because I'm all out of wood, even though I have a tree farm. Right, just showing you off. Oh, 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 look, it grew already. Oh my goodness, I got wood for days now. Well, not really. Um, but you may be wondering, what the hell are you making? Well, we got some products, right? We got oak saplings. And that's apple oak. Uh, okay. Um, you know, I'm I'm just gonna take you out because I don't think you're the correct one. Actually, you are the correct one. Hmm. 
Right, so I'm gonna use you. And the reason, the reason why, is because we are gonna make a pro tinker. Okay, fair enough. You may already notice that I'm derping like a madman. But, yeah, er, uh, right, there we go. Please let this be the recipe. Yeah, we're gonna make some better, better barrels from Jabba. Yeah, and we're gonna set them up like a madman. Right, I think, yeah, uh, this is a good place. Right, so the products we're gonna get from the tree farm, yeah, is apple oak saplings, for some reason, apples, oak wood, and the last piece we're gonna get from the tree farm is gonna be, wait for it, sand. Exactly, sand. We're gonna get sand from this one. And maybe it's already a, a cord, but nope. So yeah, I'm gonna leave this there, leave this here. Uh, uh, and in the next episode, episode uh, four, I'm gonna finish up this tree farm, get it automated, uh, you know, and set up another s uh, furnace so we can melt down everything we need to charcoal so we're gonna need another barrel and which we're gonna fill up with charcoal I know I'm thinking about everything I know because we're gonna get a decent amount of charcoal and I'm out of power again so yeah this has been the, the, the third episode hope you guys enjoyed it give it a like thumbs up if you like and uh, yeah, I will see you next episode. Yeah, take care. Woohoo. Oh my god.